Glasserick. Of terms. Star should be back to normal by, uh, 3.57 p.m. Or she won't. She won't what? Be back to normal. What's up? Star! Ugh. Nature is like a runaway dump truck. Hot, fast, and full of garbage. What? There has to be more you can tell me than that. <laughs> of course there is. But then, you're out of pudding. Hello? Stop yelling. I was in the tub. My lady. Uh, we can call back. No, it's fine. I'm just doing a little gardening. <gasps> what happened there? We fear that the wand has been cleaved. Cleaved? Now that's a funny word. You can cleave something apart, or you can cleave something together. Glossaric. If I go like this, with both of my arms, down goes my bath towel. Cleaved from my body. <coughs> Glossaric? Towel, please. No problem, Your Highness. I hope you found all the pieces of the wand. Is this some kind of training thing or something? Are you some kind of training thing? Are you mad? Is this wolf kebab rock bandage? Ba -ba 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 stop, stop, stop it. Just tell me how to get out of here. Okay, I'll tell you what to do. Are you listening? <sighs> yes, I'm listening. To reach the chunks in the hobo's stew, find her secret. That's the clue. So if I find her secret, the door's just gonna magically open? Goodbye. Teach me. The lesson begins inside my eyeball. And your wand is the spoon. Now... Oh, my wand isn't a spoon. It's a wand. It's a metaphor, Star. No, it's a wand. Fine, it's a wand. Ow. Ah, Marco, my boy, how's it going over there? Yeah. Oh, you know, just trying to find her secret in a closet full of secrets. Yes, well, you know, I do this because I love you. Okay, that's a little weird. <laughs> oh, I'm sure it is. <laughs> Okay, that's not good. Tell me what I'm supposed to be looking for! Oh, my eyes! Oh, so this is the thing! Bingo! Um, 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 um. You must try it. <laughs> Whoa! Cheers! Cheers! For the last time, there are no giant invisible goats. Oh, sure there are. You just need to believe. Now, if you want to save Star, trust in goats. Fine. If it saves Star, I'll believe. 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 Invisible goat! <laughs> I'll take the goat. Please. <laughs> oh, Margo, the goat left long ago. <laughs> oh no! What happened? Uh, I had an accident. Glossaric! Inside voices, please. Oh, sorry, yeah. Uh Glossaric. There's something funky happening with my wand. Oh, what's wrong with it? It's acting weird. It's not doing what it's supposed to. Look, Star, maybe there's something wrong with you. You ever think about that? And what's that supposed to mean? Uh, I'm not 100% sure. I guess it means there's something wrong with everyone. I mean, look at me. I did magic on my own face, you know? No help as usual. It hurts everywhere. 
car! The lid! It isn't holding! Lazarus! I give you a choice. Come with me, or die. Warnicorn Stampede! Fine. Have it your way. It's going to be pretty hard to miss from here. Star! Sorry we hurt your feelings. Oh, you didn't hurt my feelings. I have no feelings. That was all part of the plan. What do you mean, part of the plan? Yeah. Why'd you lock yourself in the donut box then? I went into that box on purpose because I needed to get to that candy. Oh. Wait, why? Well, how would you rocket yourself from a trash compactor? What? I don't know. Marco, Marco, I had to be in that donut box so I could land at Ludo's feet to trip him up and save the day. Wait, wait. So you're saying you did all that on... Boom Nugget! <laughs> How did that happen? The only way to find out is to go into... Your wand. What? You can do that? Of course, but we won't. Why not? Because, by decree of Moon the Undaunted, Queen of Muni, you must be that tall to go on this ride. <sighs> Mother. Well, I, Star the Underestimated, future Queen of Muni, hereby decree. Put me in my wand. Okay. As I was saying, the wand is an extension of your memories, so you must find the thing that does not belong. Good. Are you ready? Maybe. All right. We're inside. What? But we're still in my room. We're in the memory of your room, inside of your wand. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> All right, that's not good. That's not good. We got to get out of here. Step into my eyeball. I yes, that's what I said. Come on, hop in. All right, that's it. Oh boy, that hurt. I'm not tall enough to go on this ride. I'm not tall enough to go in any ride, but I've been on them all. Are you listening to me? This is They're not a good right time. This is the worst time. Star, I'll be right back. Just hang up. Don't turn the page. are on the fritz, too. <laughs> now, now, Mr. Glosseric, no, no magic in the building. You're probably wondering why you're here. Children, the only thing I wonder is why you waste my time. <laughs> Don't call me children! You're the children! I've got chest damage bigger than you! Romulus. Romulus, you still mad about my last visit? Yeah. <laughs> 
Excuse me. Sorry, I don't mean to be rude. Getting stronger, though, huh? That's good. You always do this! Now you bring me here while I'm at work. Doing my job. I want everyone to be on their toes, especially Star. I need you to accelerate her training. Yeah, no. Why all the riddles? You were always very direct when you were training me. Ah, well, it finally happened. Every queen wants to tell me how to do my job. My training was different. You know what Glosseric hears? Me, 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 me. I'm going to pull my mentor away from his job so I can be in the spotlight again. The only butterfly to leave me be was your great, 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 great grandmother, Eclipsa, the Queen of Darkness. I like your natural headlamp, Glosseric. It's not natural, but thank you. Hey, star, star, star. Yes! Interrupter? Are you gonna use this? What is it? I don't know. It's like a spell. There's a little drawing of a rat or something. Uh, we're kind of in the middle of something. So I can do whatever yeah, I... Whatever. Go. Wait, mm. is that pudding? A whole tub of pudding. Where are you? In flavor heaven! No, physically, where are you? On the ground? No, where are you in the universe? Oh, right. I'm in a cave. On the ground. Glossaric! Come on! The spying spell doesn't work that way. Sorry, I belong to the book, and the book belongs to Ludo now. Ludo stole you! He, uh, well, that's out of my hands. Come on, Glossary, I can almost reach you! Come on! Yes, you are surprisingly close. Glossary, don't you want to come with me? I thought we were friends. Friends? Well, that's such a simple concept. Yes, probably, but you'll be fine. Or not. Anyway, your spell is collapsing. But I need you! Maybe this is what you need. What? Glossaric's gone? Oh! <laughs> uh, yeah. Glossaric's gone? <laughs> this is amazing! I mean... It's actually really bad, <laughs> but it's good for me. <laughs> but yeah, wow, I mean, that's bad news for the universe. Why? The thing about Glossaric is, he may be a jerk, but he's the most powerful, all-knowing magic jerk in the universe. That's why I can never win an argument with him. Well, well, well. How do you like my monster temple? Pretty cool, huh? My wand told me where to find it. It's... Ah! Hello. What are you doing? I was just out for my morning stroll. But then who is in your bed? Oh, 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 oh. easy, <laughs> easy. Don't shoot. It's, uh, it's just my robe. Hmm. I thought there'd be more people. Hello, Glossaric. Hello, Toffee. Time to give it up, old man. You'll never get him on your side. But I don't have a side.
I told you, it's not your book anymore. <gasps> okay. Maybe it just needs a little space. Yes, that's it. I'll just come back some other time. Booyah! A spell, of course. Why didn't I think of this before? I wouldn't do that if I were you. Levitato! Well, if you don't want me in your book, then I don't want me in it either! Well, Coffee, looks like you finally got him to do what you wanted. I didn't want this. This was all Ludo. But now that you're gone, I can finally get him to do what I wanted. I'd love to chat more, but it looks like you're out of time. Hmm, you know, even though I knew this was coming, it's, a, uh, it's still kind of a surprise. Yay! Hey, 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 look! It worked! Hey, Star! Does this need, uh, salt? Hey, 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 excuse me. Oh, knock it off! Less salt? More salt? <laughs> More salt. What is wrong with you? What is going on here? Where am I? I have no idea. No one's ever been here before. Oh, no. I'm dead. I'm dead. I died! <sighs> well, if you're dead, then I'm dead. And if you're calling me dead, I find it... Well, I find it a little insulting, frankly. Oh, no. I am totally dead. And I'm stuck here with you. Uh-huh. Again, a little insulting. You betrayed me. I'm sorry it seemed that way. Can we get beyond this and just enjoy our time here together in wherever we are? I'm gonna stay here with you, eat your dumb magic soup, while Toffee is out there doing who knows what. Star. Marco and my mom probably think I'm dead. Star. <gasps> Maybe I am dead. Star. Look at me. This is where we are now. And this soup is not magic anymore. It's just soup. So stop being foolish and eat the soup. Hmm? Glossary! 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 Baloo, 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 I let you go, I let you go, I let you go! Say this would happen. Glosseric, you never made it easy learning from you. <sighs> but maybe that was the point. You did always trust me to figure things out on my own. And you were still always there for me. And no one else was really always there for me. Teacher, friend, weird book guy, whatever you were. 
You were super important to me. Thank you, Glosseric. Thank you for everything. I hope you find your big bowl of pudding. <gasps> Do you hear something? <laughs> Mom! Dad! Star, I'm not going to tell you again. Stop kicking doors. Mom! Mom! Oh my goodness, you won't believe it. Okay, I was at the sanctuary and I was saying goodbye and I really said goodbye and then all this magic shot out of the well and- <gasps> Slow down, slow down. What in the world are you talking about? I did what you said. I did it. I let him go. I did your balloobily, but he came back. Globgor. What did you just do? Where is she going? Globgor, 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 Globgor. Yes, Glasseric, Globgor, we know. No, no, no. Eclipse's monster love Globgor. She's going off to be with him. I've been trying to tell you for months. Anyway, see you around. Is his voice different? Okay, Glosseric, here's what's going down. I need your help, but I don't have time for any of your weird riddles. I am going to ask you a question, and you are going to answer it, okay? Okay. I think the reason I can't find my mom is because something happened to her when we went to the magic dimension. But I can hardly remember what even happened there. What did the magic do to my mom? You're asking the wrong question. The real question is, what were you doing in the magic dimension at all? That was your first mistake. What are you talking about? I had to go there to find my mom, just like I had to go there to defeat Toffee. Maybe that was a mistake too. Huh? All I did was ask Rombulus if he would use his powers to free Globgor from his crystal. He got mad. He did words or exchange, yada, yada, yada. I think he might be dead. What? Well, dead or in a dream of sleep forever. I'm not sure which. I didn't know what to do, so I brought him back here. Whoa, 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 wait. Didn't the entire kingdom see you do that? Oh, no. I'm pretty sneaky. Any progress, Glosseric? Progress? <laughs> I don't work for you. Poke. Hold on a second, will you? Hey, uh, Star, Glosseric let me borrow one of his swim trunks, but I think they're too small. They look great on him. Huh? Glosseric? Are you in two places at once? Uh, sometimes one place isn't interesting enough. Can I just get your opinion on these trunks before we go? Marco, I am busy. Just pick a sweatsuit. <laughs> oh, looks like someone fed yada yada berries to Manfred. <laughs> Wait, yada yada berries, what's that? Yada yada berries? You know. You feed them to someone and yada yada. They never bother you again. Funny thing about them, though. They're actually quite delicious once you get past the whole turning to stone part. So good. Boss Rick, what about this one? No. Okay. Well, this, this one, perhaps. Nah. You're not even looking. Oh, 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 oh yeah, yeah. My arm. Just a little boo-boo. Nothing to really worry about. <laughs> oh, no, 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 don't cry. Your buddy Glasserick's okay. Look, look, I've got another arm. Plus, I've got this silly hat. <laughs> now, as your guide to all magical matters, are you ready to continue our lessons? <laughs> Have you been practicing the dip-down exercises I taught you? No, no. <laughs> No, 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 no! I know how much joy this brings you. Let's get going. Wait, wait! Don't go in there without me. To complete your lesson, we gotta go back in time. And we need father time for that. Oh, yes, 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 I can go back in time. But I can't take a passenger with me. That's why we need father time. You have arrived at the time you seek. Okay, great. Thank you. Come on, let's go, Meteora. Bye, Dad. Oh, oh my goodness. They keep you well fed, don't they? All right. Are you ready for your lesson? Because we're here. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> my
Where are we? Who are we? Uh, Rinaldo brought us back too far. Let's go, Meteora. Wait, 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 wait. Do you... Do you know who we are? Uh... Yes? Can you help us? Uh, fine. Let's just do the abbreviated version here. A long time ago arrived the first settlers of Muni. That's you. Wow. A modest people with noble pursuits, life, liberty, and corn. The end. Oh, one, one more thing. Mind if I borrow your rattle? Eeny, meeny, muny, mo. Okay, you, mo. Here you go. Uh. Congratulations! You can do magic with that thing. Okay. Come on, Meteora. We gotta hitch another ride with my weird son. Oh, and another one more thing. There's a storm coming, so y'all might want to huddle around that stump. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> Here's a free extra lesson for you. Don't have children. <gasps> hey, Toffee! Who said that? Oh, hello again. Sorry for interrupting your weird meeting, but I'm trying to teach this little girl a lesson. What are you trying to teach her? How to get your arm broken? <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's the bad boy who broke my arm. <laughs> oh, whoa, hold your horses. I'm sure Toffee had a good reason for doing what he did. You were making that stupid leaf hat, so I snapped your arm. Okay, not the best reason, but that doesn't mean he has to keep on doing terrible things. If he did, he'd break my other arm. Oh, huh. that's a good idea. <coughs> Maybe that baby isn't the one who needs to be taught a lesson. Maybe we came to teach you. Well, what are you going to teach me? This is the threat of magic. This is what we're at war against. I guess you learned two lessons today. How to dip down, and that jerks like him never learn. You know, I think magic's in pretty good hands. Glazerick! Glazerick! What? What are you doing? Uh, shopping for antiques. No, you're not. This stuff is mine. This is my secrets closet. You don't get to shop in here. Oh. Oh, I get it. You, you think that I'm the only person who takes things out of your closet. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Milady, a patron sent these over for you. Pudding. Hmm. <laughs> Stupid magic eyeball ride! Stupid magic glasseric dimension! Well, that hurts my feelings. Wait, where's Marco? So, no magic means no Marco? Actually, no magic means no glasseric. Marco will be fine. <laughs> I can't believe you actually did it! It looks like the Age of Magic is coming to a close. Well, for what it's worth... <laughs> I think you made the right choice. I'm proud of you, kid. Wazerig, what's what's going to happen to you? Well... A good captain always goes down with his ship. 